series and uh, my challenge is going a uh, mission to Mars. Mis the mission to Mars challenge was very exciting and very nice. This is my mission to Mars tab. Um, all games I know have a web thing that they come from, like a w website or or the person that made the game. So my name is Zori Zganani. So I put ZG Studios. And then when you play the game, it goes like that noise that I think I like. I found it on Scratch. And then it goes to this home screen and plays this nice music. So if you press how to play, it tells you all the instructions that you basically use. And it takes you back in a few seconds and you can play a game. I coded the asteroids that they can't hit her because asteroids don't usually hit her. So you use the arrow keys to navigate. Um, but then when you hit asteroid, it says mission failed. So I I know you just have to restart the whole game and and when you reach Mars, when you reach nah, when you reach Mars, this backdrop appears. That's one of my favorites. It's like this home screen backdrop except without the mission to Mars and without these button spikes. My favorite part was that I, I get to use Scratch. I I hasn't haven't used Scratch for such a long time. And what do you like most about Scratch? Scratch that you can code different lots and lots of different things. Okay, now I finally made it to Mars. The robot walks away from the rocket. And you just press the space bar to start. You have to collect all the uh, uh, well items, but you have to get at least 55 points. Uh, and you have a time where your air tank is low. And then when your score gets below zero, there's too much poison from the space bugs. But then, if you get all 55 points, it goes like mission successful, and then it, the rocket blast is off and. It's it's the end of the game. It says thanks for playing at the end. So I made the first level kind of easy, but then I wanted to make the second level a little bit harder. So I've made lots of different sprites that see it goes this when it's mission successful. Mission successful, thank you for playing. And then that's the end of you do. But 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 let's say if you run out of time. Then, the then it will say that time is your air tank. So if your air tank runs out, then you have 20 seconds. But if your air tank runs out, it says air tank out of air. And then it's very hard to say out of air because, oh, I'm sorry. I'm very good at this game. So if you run out of air, it will probably look like... It will probably look like like this blue thing. It's blue words that say you run out of air. See, I, if you run out of air, I only have 10 seconds, right? 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And then it says too much poison, score below zero. It's too much poison and score below zero. So when when it's too much poison and score below zero, you have to restart the whole game because you can't play if it's too much poison. Well, I I was actually very surprised because we when the results came out, we were actually on vacation. Mm -hmm. So I was in the other room when my mom got the results. Everybody shouted. I was like, "What happened?" And then <laughs> and then and then they told me I won. I still didn't believe I won. Now I'm just starting um, doing code uh, like that coding with with the uh, robots with the big screens. I really like that the teachers in my class um, give me very hard challenges, and when the robot doesn't work, they don't give up to stop fixing it. I liked robots since I was little, so I, I would build lots and lots of robots, but 
the robots won't just be any toy robots. They would be robots that help other people and help make people's lives easier.